Leslie Buck was a greatly loved and respected second grade teacher at Dean's Mill School. She was very passionate about teaching, very dedicated to her students, and was known for her love of literature. In May 2002, a fund was formed in Mrs. Buck's honor to promote the love of literature and other enriching activities for children in the Stonington Public School System. Today, all the elementary, middle, and high schools unite to share Leslie Buck's love of reading and learning. In Leslie Buck's memory, all third graders now benefit from a trip to the library to receive a library card if they don't already have one. The library cards were distributed by the library director, Margaret Victoria. Bobby. All right, so then Tyler. Also, the Leslie Buck Fund partnered up with the Rotary Clubs of Mystic and Stonington to provide all third graders with their very own Webster's Dictionary. You're alive. Hi, <laughs> Kat. You're welcome. Now, Leslie Buck was a second grade teacher at Dean's Mill School, and we started a group in her honor, in her memory. Um, because she thought that reading and writing was so important for all you students. And so we do various um, projects and um, activities. And we got together with these other groups and we brought you here and paid for the bus to get you here so that you could get your library card and you could get a new dictionary to start you off with reading and writing. All the kids enjoyed the field trip to the library to become familiar with what it has to offer. Children's librarian Maris Fry walked the students through the library, read to them in the reading corner, and organized a scavenger hunt to help the students become acquainted with the library. We get to figure out which portrait was hanging in the upstairs. Third graders of Dean's Mill, West Vine, and West Broad all were given this wonderful opportunity. The Leslie Buck Fund is so pleased to see such a wonderful foundation being created for a love of reading through the administration of new library cards and dictionaries.